biggest race in uh, the United States, so it means a lot for us to go out here and put on a good showing. We're happy to have Honda PR guru uh, Sage Marie behind the wheel. He's going to be jumping in at pit 10, and he's going to take it to the finish. So he's a great wheel man, and we're thrilled to have him back racing the Ridgeline. We're going to take advantage of the fuel economy, larger fuel cell. We've been working a lot on our speed of our pit stop. We're hoping to make up a lot of time in the pits. You know, hopefully it all evolves by pit 10 and Sage can take it to the finish. Sometimes it can be follow the leader and uh, you're just always looking for ways to uh, pass your competition and really strategize with our pits. You know, so far the, the first half went really well for us. You know, we're out there battling. The, the silt is really, really tough. You know, fortunately we made it here first on the road. I think we got about a 15, 20 minute lead right now, which isn't enough going into the final 200 miles, but uh, the truck's in good hands with Sage and uh, they're gonna bring it to the finish. He's driven the Ridgeline uh, for the Baja 1000 in our inaugural race back in 16. second time in the truck and uh, he's just a really good methodical uh, wheelman. Second place truck was coming up on us, he's making some time and as they came through the final pit at pit 14, I uh, radioed over to them, they, they needed to push a little bit harder and unfortunately they pushed it over a cliff. It took us a little bit to recover it, but we're happy to be here at the finish. You know, we're gonna regroup and uh, start preparing for the 50th anniversary of the Baja 1000. We're rolling out a new paint scheme for the race and uh, we're gonna be at SEMA and we're really excited to get down to uh, La Paz.